Lainey Wilson is one of the most popular country artists around and she has been for the last few years. However, some of her biggest fans may be surprised to learn that she received a lot of rejection before she finally made it big, including rejections from popular singing competitions like American Idol and The Voice. So, what was life like for her before she got her big break? When listeners think of some of the biggest current country artists making waves in the industry, Lainey Wilson is right up there with the best of them. In addition to putting out a succession of top hits, Lainey has also branched out into other things. Lainey Wilson had a popular recurring guest role on the hit Western drama Yellowstone. Recently, she even opened up her very own Louisiana-themed bar in the heart of downtown Nashville. With everything she is going right for her now, you would not think that this CMA winner would have been previously rejected by singing competitions. After hosting the CMA Awards and walking away with two pieces of hardware, Lainey Wilson recently reflected on the earlier part of her career, including some of the bumps in the road and the roadblocks she faced. Many of her fans may not realize this, but the singer previously auditioned for American Idol and The Voice. If fans are curious as to why they may not remember seeing her audition for either show, it's because she never even made it through to those stages. According to Wilson, she auditioned a whopping seven times for each show, adding, I never made it through. While she did make it though on American Idol once, she never made it beyond the first round. So, she had to go back to the drawing board and figure out her next move. Lainey Wilson is further proof that just because some doors close on your dreams, it does not mean that others won't open. Lainey Wilson and Morgan Wallen led the pack when it came to this year's CMA nominations. As listeners may remember, Morgan Wallen did not make it very far on The Voice during his run either. Now these two are some of the biggest names in all of country music. Wilson is living proof that sometimes you have to take the longer path, but with enough grit and determination, you can still end up where you have always wanted to be. Lainey Wilson, now a powerhouse in the country music scene, is no stranger to rejection. With her bold lyrics, signature twang, and undeniable star quality, it's hard to believe that some of the world's most popular music competitions once told her no. Yes, Lainey Wilson, Grammy-winning artist, CMA Female Vocalist of the Year, and country music's newest sweetheart was rejected by both The Voice and American Idol. For Wilson, those moments of rejection weren't the end of her story but rather the beginning of a journey that would test her resilience, refine her craft, and ultimately lead her to a level of success she hadn't dared to imagine. Lainey Wilson grew up in Baskin, Louisiana, a town so small it's almost a dot on the map. With a population of fewer than 300, Baskin was far from the bright lights of Nashville, but it was there that Wilson's love for music took root. Her father, a farmer and mechanic, introduced her to country greats like Buck Owens and Glenn Campbell, while her mother exposed her to pop legends like Madonna. This eclectic blend of influences shaped the unique sound Wilson would later become known for a perfect mix of old-school country and modern-day flair. I always knew I wanted to do something big, Wilson shared in an interview. I didn't know how, but I knew I wanted to use my voice and tell stories. As a teenager, Wilson dreamed of making it big through a talent competition. Shows like American Idol had launched the careers of household names like Carrie Underwood and Kelly Clarkson, and she believed it could do the same for her. Wilson auditioned for American Idol in her late teens, performing with the hope that her deep, soulful voice would set her apart. Instead, she was sent home. I thought, this is my shot. This is how I'm going to get noticed, Wilson recalled. When they told me no, I was devastated. I started questioning if I was even good enough to chase this dream. Undeterred, Wilson kept pursuing her passion and eventually decided to try her luck with The Voice. By then, the show had gained a reputation for discovering raw, untapped talent. She believed this time might be different. But once again, the answer was no. They said I didn't have what they were looking for, Wilson revealed. And honestly, that hurt even more because I'd grown so much since my American Idol audition. I thought I was ready. While she didn't fit the mold of a reality TV contestant, Wilson now sees these rejections as blessings in disguise. At the time, I was crushed, she admitted. But looking back, those experiences made me work harder. They forced me to dig deeper and figure out who I really was as an artist. Instead of letting rejection define her, 
Wilson used it as fuel for her fire. She packed up her belongings, including her guitar, and moved to Nashville to immerse herself in the country music scene. I didn't have a backup plan, she said. It was music or nothing. Life in Nashville wasn't glamorous at first. Wilson lived in a camper trailer for three years while she worked odd jobs and played small gigs wherever she could. Money was tight, but her determination never wavered. I knew I had something to say, Wilson explained. I just needed the right people to hear it. Wilson's break came not from a TV show but from her own grit and determination. She began writing songs for other artists, honing her craft and building relationships in the industry. Slowly but surely, people began to take notice of her undeniable talent. Her 2019 single, Things a Man Ought to Know, became a turning point. The heartfelt track showcased her storytelling abilities and resonated deeply with listeners. It climbed the country charts and earned Wilson critical acclaim, ultimately winning Song of the Year at the ACM Awards. I poured my heart into that song, she said. It was the kind of music I always wanted to make real, honest, and unapologetically me. When Wilson shared her story about being rejected by The Voice in American Idol, fans were both shocked and inspired. Many took to social media to express their admiration for her resilience. Imagine telling Lainey Wilson she's not good enough, one fan tweeted. Those shows missed out big time. Another fan wrote, Lainey's story just proves that rejection isn't the end. She's living proof that you don't need a TV show to make it. For Wilson, those early rejections were tough, but they taught her invaluable lessons about perseverance and staying true to herself. If I'd gotten a yes from one of those shows, I don't think I'd be where I am today, she reflected. I would have been molded into something I'm not. Instead, I got to figure out who I was on my own terms. Wilson now uses her story to inspire others who are chasing their dreams. Rejection isn't failure, she said. It's just a stepping stone. Every no brings you closer to the right yes. Today, Lainey Wilson is a force to be reckoned with in country music. She's won multiple awards, collaborated with top artists, and even made her acting debut on Yellowstone. Her journey, marked by rejection and resilience, is a testament to the power of persistence. I don't regret a single no I've ever gotten, Wilson said. They made me who I am today. For anyone facing rejection, Wilson has this advice. Don't let someone else's opinion define your worth. If you believe in yourself and work hard, you can achieve anything. Sometimes the door you want to walk through isn't the one meant for you, but that doesn't mean there isn't another door waiting just around the corner. Lainey Wilson's story is a powerful reminder that success isn't always about instant recognition. Sometimes it's about taking the long road, learning from every setback, and staying true to who you are. As she continues to rise to new heights, Wilson remains grounded and grateful for the journey that brought her here. Every step, every struggle, every no it was all worth it, she said, because it led me to where I'm meant to be. And where she's meant to be is at the top of the charts, winning hearts and proving that sometimes the best stars shine brightest after rejection.